And as we leave you tonight, Church Militant captured Michigan pro-life advocates in action this past weekend, sharing their powerful message with grace. And so for those who say good things don't happen in Detroit, Church Militant's Martina Moiski reports on this positive development. The Knights like to be Knights in action. The Knights of Columbus took their message for life right out onto the streets of Greater Detroit Saturday. They gathered outside St. Pio of Petrochina Church on 13 Mile Road in Roseville. The Blessed Mother of Jesus was close to their hearts. Uh, the month of May is the month of Mary, and uh, we chose the month of May as our, our month to, uh, to be pro-life. Really, any time's a good time. It doesn't have to be just today. The Grand Knight had something to say about pro-abortion politicians receiving Holy Eucharist, an issue at the forefront of Catholic discussions in recent weeks. What we as Catholics have to do is pray. Uh, pray for our leaders offering grace, offering mercy, um, but at the same time holding to the precepts of the church uh, to understand that uh, we do stand for something. U.S. bishops continue to debate the issue as self-professed Catholic Joe Biden and other pro-abort leaders continue to receive Holy Communion, despite St. Paul's admonition to receive in a worthy manner. The Grand Knight reflected on his commitment to life. When you start exploring and, and you say, Lord, take me into the deeper water, he will definitely take you there. Saturday's march for the protection of the unborn was followed by a rosary and evening mass. Martina Moiski, Church Militant Evening News, Detroit.